Item number SCP-3956. Index. The Mealworm Song. Object Class. Euclid. Special Containment Procedures. At least one member of MTF Mu-33 showgoers must be present at all showings of musical productions in London's West End. If SCP-3956 manifests, the theatre is to be sealed off until all mealworms have been removed and all civilians inside have been amnesticized. The acting leader of MTF Mu-33 will decide whether or not an attempt to capture SCP-3956-2 will be made based on the risk of civilian casualties. All Foundation personnel investigating SCP-3956 are to wear noise-cancelling earmuffs. Description SCP-3956 is an event that manifests in theatres found in the City of London. Thus far, SCP-3956 has only been observed during performances of musical theatre. The event lasts an average of 15 minutes and is identifiable by the following occurrences. In the second act, an actor will sing an unscripted solo about mealworms for two through three minutes. The opening line is always, Mmm, tasty mealworms. During the solo, audience members who hear the song will be affected by an anomalous phenomenon. Several mealworms, four on average, though the maximum observed was 15, will emerge from the ears of affected individuals. These mealworms will then approach the stage. In later manifestations, at least one mealworm will remain in the individual's ear. At the conclusion of the mealworm song, the actor will gather and consume the mealworms on stage. This typically takes approximately 10 minutes. Once all mealworms are consumed, the audience will applaud and the show will continue as normal. Individuals who hear the mealworm song live, designated SCP-3956-1, do not perceive the event as unusual and will instead react to SCP-3956 as though it is a normal part of the show. SCP-3956-2 is a 2.1 meter tall humanoid entity composed entirely of mealworms. It first appeared during the third manifestation of SCP-3956. Following this appearance, additional recurring events pertaining to SCP-3956 manifestations have been noted. SCP-3956-2 now enters the stage at a seemingly random point during the second act and will perform the song itself. An actor being present on the stage is no longer required. Note. Please see the log of notable manifestations for details of this event. The first manifestation took place on 30-12-2016. Appearances are relatively sporadic, though seem to be increasing in frequency. A definite cause of SCP-3956 has not yet been determined. Addendum Log of Notable Manifestations This is an abridged log of manifestations. For a full list, please see document 3956-01. Date. 14-02-2017. Manifestation number 3. Show name. Wicked. Description of events. The event began as normal. However, once the compulsion was complete, SCP-3956-2 crawled out of Tracy mouth, the actress playing the protagonist, Elphaba. SCP-3956-2 attempted to perform SCP-3956. SCP-3956-1 reacted poorly to this and directed several insults towards SCP-3956-2. This caused SCP-3956-2 to flee the stage. Notes. N.A. Date. 1708-2017 Manifestation number 4 Show name 
The Book of Mormon Description of Events SCP-3956-2 entered the stage slowly and looked at the audience several times. All other actors on stage stopped and observed SCP-3956-2. After five minutes, it performed SCP-3956. SCP-3956-1 reactions were mixed, with several audience members not applauding. At the end of the show, SCP-3956-2 returned to bow with the cast. Notes The first attempt to capture SCP-3956-2 was made during this performance. Agent Fired a tranquilizer dart into SCP-3956-2. A single mealworm was dislodged from and then consumed by SCP-3956-2. Date 0601-2018 Manifestation number 9 Show name Wicked Description of events The song, No Good Deed, was cut completely from the show and replaced with SCP-3956. SCP-3956-2 was lowered onto the stage via the bubble device typically used by the character Glinda. SCP-3956 began as SCP-3956-2 descended. At the end of the consumption phase, SCP-3956-1 gave a full standing ovation. SCP-3956-2 returned to bow with the cast and performed an encore, causing another SCP-3956 event. After the show, SCP-3956-2 was sighted in the main lobby shaking hands with instances of SCP-3956-1. Notes SCP-3956-2 approached Agent The sole observer of this event, once the show had ended. It handed him a program with the message, I've seen you at all my shows. Thank you for never giving up on me. Worms, written inside along with several mealworms. It then placed its mouth against his hand and exited the lobby. Agent later described SCP-3956-2 as a talented showman 